guys i'm manda roses and welcome back to our another episode of hogwarts legacy i am so excited to be back with you guys playing this game and seeing what comes next exploring more of hogwarts going to wizarding classes checking out our common room with the raven claws it's i'm just so happy and excited I also wanted to do a little happy birthday shout out to Diedrich who said it's their birthday today. Hope you're having an awesome day and getting to celebrate and with your friends and family. So yeah, really happy that you could drop by and say hello on your birthday. Hi Joseph, how, how am I? I'm doing really well. Today I had a great day at school. So it's Valentine's Day today, which for those of you don't, who don't know, Valentine's is like Valentine's Day, but for friends. So my um, school had like a little Valentine's Day celebration where you made Valentine's Day cards, uh, which is where I stole the, the heart ribbons <laughs> from. And yeah, it was just really nice. They had lots of snacks, just kind of like hung out and did some like arts and crafts. And it was great, very therapeutic after all the busyness of like doing homework and stuff besides that. So that was really nice. How are all you guys? I hope you're having a good Monday so far. Hi Marco, happy to see you too. I'm so happy to be here. It's kind of nice. I, I feel like this is like a chance for us to celebrate Valentine's Day because I'm not going to be with you guys tomorrow because I have class. Um, and just like Tuesdays are generally can be sometimes. Well, tomorrow's Tuesday is a little bit busy. That was Valentine's Day stuff just with like actual school. But I can hang out with you guys today, play some Hogwarts and wish you all happy Valentine's. Um, so, yeah, how's everybody doing? Do you guys have any exciting dates or plans for tomorrow? Does anybody have a Valentine's? <laughs> I literally will just be in class. I might play some God of War, <laughs> just to make, you know, you can, Kratos can be my Valentine's. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm, I'm super excited to get back in this game. I've been thinking about it since we last played on, uh, what was that, Saturday? No, Friday. So I can't wait to explore Hogwarts. I want to go to class. Because <laughs> I don't get enough of school, of course, but this is different. So um, yeah, uh, I'm just... I'm very tired today because yesterday, uh, last night for some reason, I could not sleep properly. First off, I went to bed kind of later than I probably should have because I was trying to get a video ready for you guys <laughs> um, to get some God of War Kratos. God of War Kratos, what am I saying? God of War Ragnarok out. Um, I'm trying to catch up on videos and release more um, episodes. So I was editing until far too late last night. And then, um, and then I went to bed at like one o'clock. Which isn't too bad, but a little bit late for a school night. And for some reason, I woke up like an hour later. I had so many weird dreams. I like, I sometimes get these like very realistic dreams where I feel like I'm almost like hallucinating. Like they're very realistic. I had one of those. And, it was, and then and then I couldn't sleep properly like the rest of the night. So I'm super tired today. Like so, so tired. <laughs> but I'm good otherwise. Just need to sleep properly tonight. Those of you will be flying solo this Valentine's. Well, don't worry. You guys are all my Valentine's. So don't worry. If you don't have a Valentine's Day, Valentine's, you can be mine. Kevin. Hi, Kevin and everyone. You look great, Amanda. So beautiful. Thank you. What do you guys think of the pigtails? I know I don't, don't normally wear them, but I was very much just getting into the, like the Valentine's mood today. <laughs> We've got a happy birthday for Diedrich. I hope Diedrich is here or saw the message, but I don't know if Diedrich is here anymore. But either way, we're wishing a happy birthday. I'm I'm honestly so excited that we might just like get right into Hogwarts Legacy because I I want to start exploring. Um, one thing I'll say is that so last time normally when I'm on a live stream with you guys, I really try and like focus on the chat. But it's a little bit hard to do that in this game because there's so much going on that I I can't spend a lot of time. Like sometimes I can't look at the chat as much. If I'm not answering your guys's messages, if you're asking me questions. Just like wait till I am if it's in the middle of a cutscene. Just like ask again a little bit later so um in case I miss it because you know this game has a lot of cutscenes and it's really exciting so I might not be really clear in the chat hi Bruce hello fellow Ravenclaw I should have worn blue today but I was really in the mood for my Valentine's Day colors because I feel like I'm celebrating a little early with you guys Marco you tried to become Hogwarts Legacy but it sell out it was in three shops that's crazy I can't believe they sold out well I hope you managed to find a copy soon hi Chris I'm glad you could make it you look beautiful with your new hairstyle. Thank you. Um, I, I stole these. I don't know if you guys can see, but they actually have little hearts on the ribbons. And um, I was saying earlier that uh, today my school had a Valentine's Day celebration. where We made like Valentine's Day cards. So they had this like ribbon and I was like, oh, so pretty and so Valentine's. So I stole it to like put on my hair. 
I'm gonna wear it tomorrow too. <laughs> but this is our this is our channel Valentine's Day right now. So RPG Free, hello, welcome. Your first stream as a member. Yes, welcome. I'm so glad you got a member. The super generous of Marco to get those out. It's really exciting. Make sure to use lots of our channel emojis while you can. Does you love exploring Hogwarts in the game? Oh, I'm so excited to see what we're gonna find. Like I just, I don't even, like, I don't care about the story yet. I just want to do some exploring first. Like, I hope we get the chance to do that soon because I want to see the moving staircases and I want to see all the, like, uh, um, I'm just losing my train. I'm so tired. I keep losing my train of thought. Uh, oh, I want to see all the paintings, the moving staircase. I want to go see, like, the classrooms and stuff. It's so exciting. This game is literally the best. Yeah. Uh, for anybody who just popped into the stream, how are you guys doing? How's your Monday? Does anybody have any exciting plans for Valentine's Day? If you don't have Valentine's, I don't either, so be my Valentine. <laughs> I'll like, I'll make a little Valentine's Day post tomorrow. I love Valentine's Day, by the way. Not for like the romance of it, but just because I think like love and hearts are really cute. So I always get excited to like celebrate with people I care about, which involves you guys, of course. So yeah, that's why I say you guys are my Valentine's for tomorrow. RPG Freak, there's a main side character from each house. Ooh, okay, I'm excited to meet them then. I already can't wait to go make, like, <laughs> start playing and be different for myself in different houses so I can see all the, the common rooms. I especially want to see the uh, Gryffindor one because that's my, like, other house that I identify with. So I want to go see what it looks like. I'm still, like, I never, I cannot tell if I'm a Ravenclaw or a Gryffindor. I think if sometimes I'm a Hufflepuff too, but this time we're a Ravenclaw, so... Kevin, people are saying that the game is so immersive, so detailed. It seems really big and like there's so much to do. It's like you can explore Hogwarts, but then you can go out and explore the towns too. And we get to fly around on a broomstick, which is awesome. RPG Freak, they have a quest line that you can complete regarding of what house you chose. Regardless of what house you can choose. Oh, okay. That's good to know. I like that. Ugh, I'm going to switch us over to Hogwarts Legacy because I'm super excited to get started on this. But we can we can keep chatting, but... I'll put us onto the, the gaming screen. This is going to be so fun. I just... This game has really, so far, like, I'm very impressed with it. Like, very happy with what they've done. Okay. I'm still, unfortunately, streaming off my laptop. Uh, which is why the, um... The frame... Uh, the resolution is, uh, is only 720. And I'm really... I'm... I'm I set up my whole desk and everything's like ready to go. I just need to get a second monitor. So, working on that. And then we'll have slightly higher quality streams. <laughs> Bruce, it makes me happy to see how excited you get to play it. I am excited. I'm happy you guys are excited too. Marco, it brings you so close to the movies. They're making an absolutely awesome job. They matched the movies so well. Like, they really brought everything to life like I expected them to. Oh, we've got a. Oh, the, the hugs mead quest, which is what we get for being on the PlayStation. A haunted Hogsmeade shop quest, which grants access to an additional dungeon, shopkeeper's cosmetic set, and in-game Hogsmeade shot. shop. That's so sad for people who are playing on other consoles and don't get to go to Hogsmeade? Like, they should just make that available for everybody. Oh! Our hippogriff! So beautiful! I love the hippogriff. You may soar the Scottish skies on the back of this graceful black hippogriff. New mounts are accessible in the gear menu after the default hippogriff is unlocked in the main quest line. Ah, oh, Hogwarts Legacy feel like delicious, bleh, delicious <laughs> potion recipe. This recipe allows you to brew liquid luck, this is so cool, which will grant the drinker success in certain endeavors for one in-game day. Felix Felicious may be brewed and consumed after the potion station and tool wheel have been unlocked in the main quest line. So cool! Oh, so you can make other characters right from the start? Can I, like, could I just be another character as, like, a one of the other houses and go explore them right away? Okay. Just gonna turn the volume down. Okay! Oh. We're ready to get going! That's so cool. Okay, so you can already start a new game if I wanted to go, like, go see the other houses. Begin. 
Joseph, you don't see why some people think Hufflepuff isn't a good house. Imagine starting a new school this I mean, the books kind of like make them seem not very um <laughs> great, but they seem like a good house to me. I mean, being loyal is so important. Like, I to do some window shopping in Hogsmeade this weekend. Look at this. All right, we're gonna. Okay, so we need to go down a floor. Oh, it looks so good. Like, look at this place. I can't believe we get to walk around Hogwarts. Oh. Um, Huff Scorpion. Oh, wow, this cover room looks so cool. Yes, this is the Ravenclaw. Okay, I'll give you a quick tour. Isn't this so beautiful? Like, and it goes up for like three floors. It's so cool. I love the Ravenclaw one. This room especially. Look at how beautiful the ceiling is. I'm so happy. Okay. Oh, did I just break something? It sounded like I smashed something. This is cool. You can like move the pillows and stuff. It's really impressive, actually. Just the pillow though, apparently. <laughs> oh, I'm probably not supposed to be doing that. Can I hit the pillow? You can! You can destroy the pillow! <laughs> That's funny. They should oh good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. Professor Weasley! Look time. at the night in the don't background. You move. Well you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year. You'll need to catch up. Do we get to go to class? Not fall behind. I can't wait to go to Especially class. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs. We never need an owl. Owls. I want to see your owl. Yes, your ordinary oh, wizard so level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Wow, that looks so cool. The detail in this book is so impressive. Like, the visuals are just amazing. Whoa. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all the Please let's actually go to class. Year. I really want to go to classes. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. I love this. I'm so happy right now. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field. <laughs> Voldemort is here. You will die. I thought for a second that this was a... Um... Somebody actually being seriously a troll, but then I saw the Voldemort part and I'm like, ah, they're just a Harry Potter fan. Why do Much you better. cast Revelio on this bust and see what details the field guide can provide? Ooh, okay, wait, how do we? Lumos. No, that's not it. <laughs> Which one is um, Revelio again? Uh, not this one. Oh crap, I can't quite remember how to cast it. <laughs> nope, not like that. Nope. Oh, how do we cast it again? Okay, guys. <laughs> I forget. <laughs> Amanda Rose's You Will Die Voldemort is here. <laughs> Take your best shot. Um, okay, guys, help me remember. How do I do... Velio? Oh. Okay. It's just... Velio. Ah, there we go. <laughs> Ravenclaw bus. This bus created in honor of Ravenclaw House resides in the lofty Ravenclaw Tower. Hi, Texan7! Welcome to the live stream! 
You have just unlocked a field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Field guide challengers are the only way to acquire experience point. Oops, wrong one. <laughs> wow, this looks really nice. I really appreciate the uh, the menu here. Chevron 7, yay, another magical stream. Hi, welcome, I'm glad you can make it. And yes, I am so excited to be back with more Harry Potter or Hogwarts Legacy. Mo, you're eight years old when you see the first Harry Potter movie. I think it was probably around the same age too. Actually, I might've been a little bit younger, but it has stuck with me since then. This is your withering level. XP earned from challenges increases your level and power. So right now I'm very low. <laughs> your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Let's challenges menu to continue. This is such a neat menu. The book is like just really great. I love the way they did this. Selecting your first guide page unlocks a new challenge category. New challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select field guide pages to continue. Ooh, these are all really pretty actually. Like the images. The quests, I love the egg. Ooh, requirement! Oh, and of course, we want to do a lot of exploring soon. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlock in each tier you complete, from appearance to critical upgrade. upgrades. Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come back often to collect rewards you have unlocked. Rewards you unlocked. Okay. Cool! We're learning! Clever, isn't it? <laughs> Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Look at the paintings! I love watching them. Oh, this whole place is so magical. This game is perfect so far. I'm so happy with it. No time to waste. You've classes to attend. I wonder what our first class is gonna be. I wonder if we get to pick two, like, where will we take and stuff? Probably get to take all of it. I hope we get to take all of it. Whoa, what is this? Ah, apparently we're not, so, I'm, I'm gonna get so sidetracked in this game, just like constantly exploring. Look at this hallway. And the music <sighs> too. Timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames. Ravenclaw Tower! Flu flames! Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. You've discovered a flu flame! I love the name of it. Flu flame. <laughs> it's a funny word. You've discovered a flu flame. Fast travel point. You can open the map at any time to fast travel to any discovered flu flames. I have a feeling I'm not going to use this very often because I'm just going to want to explore myself. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. On the left side of the map is where students and professors live and includes the house, common rooms, and the Great Hall. Select the, okay, the Grand Staircase. Oh, I can't wait to go. In this view, you can see the flu flames available in that region. Gray flu fl green flu flames represent flames you have discovered, including your own house, common room. Gray flu flames reveal the location of undiscovered flames. I can't help laughing every time I have to say flu flames. Like, I feel like I have to say it in a funny voice, too. <laughs> but you, you feel shy to see Emma Watson in the movie? She was very cute. She was very cute in that movie. Amanda will be the most powerful witch at Hogwarts. I hope so. At some point. Oh, apparently there are over 600 collectibles in the game. That's crazy. This game, it does sound like it's quite big. Do I play other games also? I do. I'm playing God of War Ragnarok right now, Elden Ring, and Spider-Man. We're also playing... Um, Legend of Zelda on a live stream. Um, and I play a lot of other games. I have tons of other playthroughs on my channel, so you can definitely check them out under the playlist. Joseph, you can't wait to replay this game so I can get platinum. Me too. I wanna go to all the common rooms. I wanna, wanna explore everything, literally. The right side of the map is where you'll find, oh, where you? Oh, it's where you'll find academic points of interest, including the astronomy tower, the library, and the greenhouses. Oh, those are gonna be amazing. Select the library annex region to continue. Professor Weasley has unlocked the central hall flu flame for you. Use the right stick to rotate the map and fast travel to the central hall flu flame square. 
Central Hall. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Wow, look at the dragon! He's got smoke! Always something <gasps> and happening the here. Book. It's the heart of the hive. Our king's oh, it's station, so cool. so to speak. <gasps> oh, this game is amazing. I could honestly cry. It looks exactly that be like all the for now. <laughs> You'll be expected to attend both charms and defense against the dark arts. Ooh, we can do together. a defense against the dark arts. I'd like to be sure Ooh. you get to Hogsmeade for that. as soon as possible <gasps> to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Hogsmeade! Oh my god, I'm so excited. Oh. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you at the <laughs> class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Oh, Judging sure, that sounds great. Extra homework. Earlier, Except I'm excited because it's witchcraft homework, Fick so... I said Professor succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Mm hmm You could say that. Uh, we're not going to just share right away, are we? I mean, I don't think we're probably going to tell her quite yet. <laughs> Apparently there are over 600... Oh, yeah, I read that. Hi, King Morgan. Welcome. I hope you're having a good Monday. You can collect flying book pages? Oh, I love that. I'm gonna go with him for there, isn't professor, but I'm afraid that's what we probably keep this one to ourselves for a little while longer. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. <laughs> Do her glasses her glasses look like professor they don't even have lenses Fick, in them? Your ears must have been burning. Oh. <laughs> yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah. I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic it seems hmm oh interesting well, they use that uh, gender neutral pronouns there they instead of using she or her uh, she her or you he chose to fly in the path of a dragon <laughs> i wouldn't say i chose the dragon's path professor rather unfortunately it would seem that it chose us i think the details well, well, of the characters are really good too to chat. i need to get to class myself might I they don't have a ton of emotion in their face, the but it's not so bad that I'm, like, bothered by it. Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember Did to go to class now? your field guide. <laughs> it will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. We're and going to class! I'm so excited. And we'll see if we can't get so for those supplies. Look at the people casting spells in the background. Also, this fountain, it's crazy. The like, most emotional scene was when Professor Severus, when we saw his memory of when Harry's mother dies, he truly loves her. Oh, Severus' story is, like, actually very emotional and touching. Like, it's so sad. I just loved her so much. Wow, look at this. I just want to go see everything. Oh, what? We can't go back? Okay, that was weird. It's, it looks phenomenal. I want a book page. Okay, I guess we have to do this. Do this first, probably. Show on seven, probably just to cut back on the amount of dialogue needed to be recorded, yeah. Because of everything I play in this game, I put on my Gryffindor shirt and I can't find it. I put on my Gryffindor robe instead. I should be wearing a robe, probably. I have a Gryffindor shirt. I don't have a Ravenclaw one, so I need to go get a Ravenclaw one. Maybe when I, um, if I end up going to Harry Potter World when I'm in Florida, I will definitely pick up some Harry Potter merch. Hi, Jay Magician. Welcome. I'm glad you can make it today. Found our, Hog found our Hogwarts Legacy stream. <laughs> it's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? <laughs> you did, sir. 
Mm, I didn't really like lying to her. I, I did try to that. evade her questions, though I feel a little deceptive. That said, I'm fairly certain she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, yeah, of course Professor she does. You got chased a by a dragon. And the state witch. <laughs> it was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. I wonder if we'll be the potter. It may require a bit more that would be flexibility so cool. with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not so subtle reproof from Professor Weasley. Damage is from only about like two and a half hours enchantment in. We included in the field guides map. Unfold it and have a look. You can track available quests from the map. Alright, this represents main quest. Completing main quests will further the story, unlock new features, and grant XP. Some quests are locked by spells and or level requirements. In these cases, you will need to be the required level and or have the required spell to activate the quest. New skills can, can be earned by completing professor's assignments or as quest rewards. Oh, cool. Check a quest with X. Okay. The events against the dark arts and charms class. Oh, which one do I want to go to first? The field, uh... Ooh, which one should I go with? I was proud for that, 10 points to Gryffindor! <laughs> I gotta start handing out points to Ravenclaw. Wait, well, Albus Dumbledore, his phoenix, is amazing. He died and born again from his ashes. Yeah, that's a really, like, cool scene to watch from the movies. You have no... You have no lifing this game? Oh, you've been no lifing this game? <laughs> okay, we're gonna go to Charm's class first. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. <gasps> You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an oh, exceptional he's a We go to Ollivander's? I am so... I that is so cool! We actually get to get our own wand? Mysterious locket. For Ooh. now, focus on your classes and pay attention. Yeah, you don't More have to worry about that. I'm gonna be paying close attention to this. able to master within these walls. I'm so happy we're going to Ollivander's. Best complete. Welcome to Hogwarts. Best charmed compass. The charmed compass will lead you to anything you're tramping. Track, tracking. Powers should be kept in all the pure blood families, like the black. Oh, you guys hear what they were saying? Exactly like one of the lines from the book. Hogwarts should be kept to the older families. Hmm, that's rude. Is it out through here? Oh. Wow. <gasps> I love all the detail. Look at all the students from all the houses. Hey, which country do you live in, Amanda? You're from India? I'm from Canada, but I currently live in the U.S. For school. Canada! Yes, Canadian. Proudly Canadian. Wow. Every room you walk into just looks so cool. They're all so, like, different and unique. There's a marble in this one. Any idea what sort of trouble you might get yourself into? <laughs> I love this! The Howler! <gasps> that was so... Oh my god, they have so much detail in this. It's crazy. You can tell they all, like, the people who made this care about Hogwarts and Harry Potter. Ooh, this is a creepy painting. Oh. Revelia. <gasps> 
painting of Ilias. This painting depicts the young orphan wizard Ilias, who famously saved his entire village from an army of Dementors and the dark wizard Razidian by conjuring a mouse Patronus. <laughs> That's cute. We can reach the top of those buildings, rooftop you mean? I'm guessing we can once we get our broomstick. Hi Jonathan! What console am I playing this on? I am on a PlayStation 5. So I get the Hogsmeade area. Even the music in the background. Wow, there's so much detail in here. Am I going in the right direction? I have no idea. Ha! Honestly though, Peeves! <gasps> it's Peeves, guys, look, it's Peeves! Oh. We saw Peeves! Oh. I can't Someone believe we saw him! him <laughs> so, I wanted to so badly. <laughs> I'm so happy right now. <laughs> he looks so goofy. <laughs> Joseph, you love how the developers actually care about Hogwarts. They do! Hi, Rolf! I'm glad you made it! Welcome! I hope you're having a good... I guess it'd be late Monday or Tuesday for you at this point. I hope you're doing well. Are you playing Hogwarts Legacy? Jonathan, and how many gigabytes does this game have on PlayStation? I think it's about 80 gigabytes. Definitely takes up some space. <laughs> in your experience, Amanda, what a special feature in PlayStation 5? Just in general? Um, I mean, it runs, like, amazing, and games look beautiful on it. Plus, like, the DualSense controller, when it's used properly, really impressive. Really adds to the game. What house did I get in? I'm a Ravenclaw! Ta-da! Ravenclaw. I think I could have easily been in Gryffindor, too, though. I actually took the test, um, twice, um, after the stream. I, like, wanted to check, and I got Raven uh, Gryffindor the second time, so. Like, half Gryffindor, half Ravenclaw. I'm not lost quite yet. I actually just kind of want to run around and explore. <laughs> I want to see like every corner. Oh, uh, this is a really cool clock though. Everything, like all the details so far have been perfect. Oh my God, look at the same glass too. It's so pretty. Oh, well, another adventure, are we? Oh, we're not in the right area, are we? <laughs> I wish you could talk to, can you talk to people? You can't. It'd be nice if you could. Okay. Oh, is this on another floor? Oh, I'm so happy right now. Just walking around. Gargoyle, the, young, the youngin's now a teacher himself, huh? Do they talk? The music is so like classical. <laughs> Rob, just hit midnight over here, so it's Tuesday. Well, happy Tuesday. I hope you have a great Tuesday. <laughs> and I hope this is a good way to start the day. Jay Mission, you're even clad too in the game. Only thing is, you wish the color wasn't blue. Really? I love blue. Ooh, what is this? <gasps> Look, the butterflies move. Whoa, why is it blue? What is this? It's like a weird whispering coming from it. I feel like there's so many secrets to discover in here. <gasps> Let's go! <laughs> She's chasing me with a with an axe. I love that. Whoa! Look at this. Oh my god, this place is huge! Oh, all I want to do is see literally everything. Chevron 7, a griffin claw perhaps? Yeah, I think I'm a griffin claw. But this time I decided to go with, uh, with a raven claw. I think I'll play again. Next time we'll go with the Gryffindor. Um, and then after that, Hufflepuff, and then Slytherin. I like Slytherin, but I don't, I think it's probably the least my last, like, one close to me. Oh, I love how the knights move. <gasps> I can't 
cat! Wait, wait, can we pet the cat? <gasps> Guys, we can pet the cat! <laughs> Look at the kitty! Oh my god, they better. Oh my god, I want to pet all the cats! I'm petting the cat again. I'm petting the cat again! <laughs> it's so cute! Oh, I miss having a cat in real life. Like, I, I don't know why, because I haven't had a cat in like a year or two. It might be two years at this point since my dear kitty Twinkle died. And uh, I love cats, but I haven't really thought about it in a while. And for some reason today, I've just been like really wanting a cat around. Like, I want to have a cat cuddled up on my lap right now. Oh, I miss pets. I miss them so much. Kevin, can you change your house or not? You can't change it for a playthrough, but you can start a new playthrough and have a, and have a different house in that. That runs out in 10 out of 10 game? So far, yes, absolutely. Especially if you're a Harry Potter fan, you're gonna love this. So if you, was walking around, you were walking around Hogwarts the other day and it's so massive, couldn't explore it all sadly because of your job. I think it's gonna take a long time to see everything. Ralph, you did a what house are you test once and had to answer many questions to get the following result. Not allowed in Hogwarts? No way, Ralph. You better be allowed in Hogwarts. I will not allow you to be not allowed here. <laughs> I'm guessing you're not playing Hogwarts Legacy then. Look at the paintings! This game was based on the first movie. It's actually based um, before the movies. So it's in the, set in like the 1800s. So it's a completely different story um, and set in the past. Did you mention you thought Ravenclaw had purple as their color? Nope, it's blue. <laughs> Although I'm wearing purple right now, so that would work out very well if it was. Uh, Texan 7, does change your house give you a different experience? Um, I think you have the same story, you just get a different common room? Somebody else can maybe answer this. Oh right, I'm supposed to be going to class. <laughs> How do we get to class? A cat! I love it. Travel broadens the mind. Ignatia Wildsmith? I love that they talk. This place is so big! Pavilion. I love seeing, like, in the subtitles, Amanda Rose's casting a spell. <laughs> it's so cool. Very little difference in some side quest story is the same. Okay. Yeah, I'm guessing the experience is largely the same. Wow, look at this! It's got the three-headed dog! This place is gorgeous. There's literally so much to see. Oh, they keep going to the bathroom! <laughs> they have all the details. You can even watch it. Wait. <laughs> is this a bathroom or is this where people are casting spells? Somebody's just got some... You can flush the toilet. They literally thought of everything. Somebody's just got their spells going on in here. Oh, there's a talking mirror. Me, you are a lost cause, aren't you? Oh. <gasps> this is crazy. I'm gonna spend way too long exploring. You guys just better get used to this. I want to see everything. Oh, we found a, a potion. Hey, Mission, you like the clothing, though it looks like real 1800s classic clothing, unlike most things set in this time period. They just put everyone in modern suits. Yeah, it does look a lot better. They, I'm pretty impressed. Like, look at the outfit. It's, it definitely looks older. Francisco, hello! Have you had a peek at the trophies and any of them you are more interested about? I haven't checked them yet, actually. I'm super early on in the game still. We've only been, we're like just getting past the like tutorial. So we're going to our first classes, but before the next live stream, I will check that out and let you know. Is Moni and Riddle in here? Has she died yet? I want to see her. This place is so cool. Oh, Professor's Fake's classroom. How nice to see you, my young friend. Oh, wait, this is where we just were. <laughs> Another bathroom. Look at all the art. <gasps> Another chest. Oh, we can't get it yet. <laughs> I 
there's a lot to interact with as well. Okay, we have to figure out <laughs> how to get to potions class. Maybe I can check on the map. Side quests are now available. Side quests can be found inside regions of Hogwarts marked with the black flag and discovered by exploring the world. These quests reward XP, but do not advance the main story. Okay. Can you zoom in at all? Oh yeah, you can. You can't really see like the different levels. Okay, we're close. We're close to where we need to be. We need to go up. This place is literally huge. So you guys have been sad lately because Rocky passed away six weeks ago today. I'm so sad to hear that. Oh, losing a pet is just horrible. It's so, so hard. Hmm. Rocky. Why is Cerberus here? <laughs> Throwback to uh, the first part of um, the first book. Look at this. There is such cool detail here. And the statue? Well, the don't necessarily want him to get back to the lesson. Came up with new moves yet. Rebellion. It's impossible oh. to do all of the homework they give you. I think they do it on purpose. Definitely relating to these students right now. <laughs> I have too much homework. <gasps> Our first class. I'm so excited. <gasps> We're going to a wizarding class. I literally feel like a kid right now, like the amount of excitement I feel. <laughs> so happy. Here. Behind you, there is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident <laughs> it's got you quite will take the home the passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right, now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Uh, 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 I am afraid it is too late to study now. <laughs> oh, mm. yikes. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays the practicing and little, like, oblivion on one things. another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? <laughs> At least I have the excuse of being brand new here. Uh, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take <laughs> positions on opposite sides like of the him. classroom. He's got a now flair for the dramatic. Now let's put those to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only Ooh, one book will be needed spell? for partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Another spell! Ralph, you might get this a try sometime. You got too much stuff on the moment. New PC to build, Horizon, Call of the Mountain, and Burning Shores DLC, and working full time. A lot to do with so little time. I fully understand, Ralph. I'm feeling the same way. So many games that I want to play and that I have going, but we're doing our best to make time. If you are a Harry Potter fan, I would definitely recommend this game. It's fantastic. Also, did you get the PlayStation VR 2? Are you gonna, are you, are you playing Call of the Mountain? I am absolutely so incredibly jealous i desperately want the psvr2 just for that game i so badly want to play call of the mountain but i cannot afford to buy it but i'm like oh i want to so badly i'm so jealous you'll have to tell me all about it when you do play it tell me how good it is if it's worth it maybe maybe i'll be able to save up and buy one at some point i am very excited for the dlc though we're talking about higher than forbidden west by the way um in James Shane, you like how you can tell the clothing is made of wool or cotton if you look closely. It doesn't just look like polyester. James Shane, I can always count on you for those kind of details, but I love it. Okay, you think they will make 10 parts of this game? Hogwarts back with so many stories. Maybe. I wouldn't be surprised if they made another one if it's, if it's successful. Okay, anyways. Ralph, you pre ordered PSVO 2 Plus Call of the Mountain a few weeks ago. Oh, 
I'm so happy for you, but I'm also so jealous. Like, I want it so badly. Ugh. I hate being a grad student sometimes. <laughs> I just want to spend, I want to work so I can spend money on video games. <laughs> just if you love the professor for Chimes class, he is so funny. He is so great. Okay. Study your run with Al and guide it through the. Okay, let's do this. You kind of have to do this fast. A new spell! How do you pronounce it? Accio? Accio? Accio. <gasps> wow. Clearly, we've got a. Um, that is not bad. Talent you are for this. <laughs> a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. Don't worry, I'm gonna be you practicing my spells all the time. Here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot this is of so fresh fun. air. After Mark Sloane. I like him. I like him a lot. Being a student at Hogwarts would be so easy because I'd be so excited to learn magic that I would like study all the time. Like I don't know how any people here are not just studying constantly. <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Uh, hmm? When are we going to get Quidditch? <laughs> so, better be a DLC what better there. than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? Hi. <laughs> 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 so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Eh? Gonna put us on the spot here. <laughs> Ralph, you think you've seen the first four or five Harry Potter movies, but you remember very little about it. On one I don't... Of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward you. The trick is to pull the sphere as far as possible, but not a bit more, or it'll fall. Yes? I'm gonna be no, terrible at this, probably. I'm really bad at judging this in video games. Okay. is the best professor. Show us how it's done. Um, Ralph, I would recommend rewatching some of the movies first and see if it interests you. Okay, the summoning charm, Accio, Accio. Pull the target closer to the caster. Hold R2 and press the assign button to cast Accio, and pull the target closer. Press the button again to release casting the spell. Excellent, good. Ah. Uh. the best of us. <laughs> See, I told you I'm not gonna be very good at this. Splendid! Damn it! Don't lose your composure. <laughs> no points. That's it. Yay! We got it. Oh, come on! Stop! Don't roll. We did it! <laughs> One out of three. Very good. Points to Ravenclaw. But Ooh. there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. Uh, my sister's calling me right now. I'll have to tell her to call you me back. Okay. Blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? I'm just gonna message my yes. sister. I was supposed to talk to my twin last night, um, but she didn't get home from work until like, um, I was, uh, hold on. All right, we're gonna put this on pause real quick. One quick second, guys. This will only take me a second. I was supposed to hang out with my twin yesterday and um, she got home from work too late. She's in a different time zone, so I couldn't hang out with her. I miss my sister so much. I miss my family in general a lot. Uh, but yeah, anyway, back to the game. <laughs> uh, oh, it's doing well. All right, my turn. This is so fun. All right. I love that we get to like compete. Damn it, so close. Oh, she's gonna beat me, isn't she? Wow, she's too good. That's not fair. She's way too good. Yay! Very good. 
Oh man, there's no way I'm gonna win now. Is she gonna get three for three? Oh come on, how is she back in? <laughs> That's not fair, she did perfect. Oh, come on, come on. Yay! Well, we got two out of three. Quite impressive. <laughs> Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Oh, another round, huh? <laughs> You're doing the same as me when I you played this part? <laughs> interesting at this oh, point. this is gonna be hard. <laughs> I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Let us see this. She's gonna be way too good. How is this fair? How is she this good at it? <laughs> that is how it's done. She got hers to go in the middle, too. And you're blocking my view. Yeah. Oh, no! Damn it! I did it too far again. Happens to the best Ow. of us. <laughs> oh, she's gonna win. Here we go. Too good. Oh, did I screw it up? Come on, a little bit further. Darn. <laughs> I really need to catch up on points here. I don't think I'm gonna win. <laughs> She's way too good at this. Well, <laughs> we definitely lost by a lot, but it's something. <laughs> you think it happens before Very the movies? Yes, it is before. You. Well done. You're the pretty twin admitted? No, we are both equally pretty and it is not a competition anyways. I think you need to find special magic, magic sticks. <laughs> your things on the way I out. want my own wand, guys. <laughs> It was a little difficult well, for me the first time for me as well. You took yeah, the in it's not style. like the hardest thing, Didn't but want to definitely not easy on you. as easy as she took makes it look. Took weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right. Professor is not teaching very well. Yeah. <laughs> it gets easier, I promise. I'm glad you understand. I like her so far, it's this character. To, in all at once. to put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, oh, we had way to travel. Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. I love her accent. It sounds beautiful. RPG Freak, stick with Natty as your main friend, please. I haven't found a playthrough yet where anyone does that. I will... I mean, I haven't met the others yet, but I will definitely think about that. I really like her so far, so... I wouldn't be surprised. I, I, so far, I'm like, yes, that would be great. Oh, that's really cool. I'm gonna. I would love to learn more about Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So, yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it <laughs> never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a, castle of the moon. As a beautiful edifice carved out of the wow, mountain. Wow, that side. does sound beautiful. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized. It'd be really cool me. if they made some this games where you went to the other Hogwarts or the other Wizarding schools. Wow, that sounds beautiful. I would love to see this. Who was born first? You or your sister? I was born first, actually, by half an hour, which is quite a long time for twins. Um, and actually, funny story, so when we were really young, like, I didn't quite understand time yet, like, what a half an hour meant. My mom used to tell us that we were uh, an episode of Dragon's Tales apart. <laughs> we knew, like, what an episode of Dragon's Tales was kind of like. So she would tell us that's how long it was between when we were born. Shout out to anybody. Sh shout out to Dragon's Tale, if anybody used to watch that. 
Because so if you think your main friend is Hufflepuff. Well, I am a Gryffindor, so it makes sense for me to be friends with the Gryffindor. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. Really? I wonder what they use instead. That's incredible. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Wow, that's it's fascinating. quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. <laughs> That's so neat. I never knew that. That like, I wonder if that's something that um, Shishu shall not be named <laughs> came up with, or if the developers came up with that. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. They should definitely make another game where you go there. But I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Of course, you can use Accio on humans, if you're so inclined. Well, you'd be using it on clothing, to be precise, Sebastian. You know it won't work on humans. Interesting, why? A word, if you would. Yes, sir. I want to talk to Professor Rodin. He's so funny. You wanted to speak with me, Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation. Well, an outdoor All the more with Slytherin. wasn't exactly the lesson <laughs> I was They don't let you forget it in the box. <laughs> what charm is there in the expected? Miss Onai is a talented witch. Take it in stride. One often gains the most from the battles one has lost. Of course, Professor. It was a challenging match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now... Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect more to homework. Soon, the only time I'm ever excited about more homework. <laughs> that I am preparing for you. Well, he, I'm okay. So in this playthrough, I'm oh, our first trophy, first class student. That's exciting. Whoa. Um, in this playthrough, I'm Ravenclaw, but I think I'm also Gryffindor. I'm a little bit of both. Uh, Griffin, uh, Gryffindor. <laughs> New quest available. I really want to go to Hogsmeade. Attend Defense Against the Dark Arts. Hey, I love the way this looks. It's so impressive. Off to defense against the dark arts. Also, though, first I want to go see what it looks like up here. Can we go up the stairs? We can. We go in his, in his. Oh, can't wait to get, be able to unlock those. I want to literally see everything. Hello. How was your first day coming along? Oh. Hello, Samantha. Samantha. Nice to see you again. I wondered how your first day was going. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. That's kind of you to say. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. <laughs> the magician, I am playing on fidelity mode. I, I wanted to stick more towards the making sure the graphics look really good since I'm live streaming it. But you can always switch back and forth between them. Hufflepuff! <gasps> look at this room! Look at the cat! Look at the cat! It looks like my cat Twinkle! Ooh, look at him! Oh, it's so cute! I love this. Look at how cool this place is, like with the purple and everything. Everything looks amazing. I'm blown away. Hey, Mena, I have to get back to work. I'll talk to you later. Don't forget to call your sister. <laughs> Bye, Chris. Thanks so much for coming. Have a good rest of your work day. And also, yes, thank you for the reminder. I will <laughs> I will call her after this. Yeah, I'll talk to you later. Bye, Chris. I love that you can spin all of these. They should give a trophy for that. I definitely want to look through the trophies and see what I need to get. 
<laughs> it's Peeves again. It's Peeves. Look, it's Feet of Menace. It's Peeves, Feet of Menace. He's so goofy looking. I love this place. Twinkle, I know I miss Twinkle. Oh, my beautiful cat. I really want a new cat. I want to. Oh, it makes me like genuinely. It makes my heart hurt to think of having a cat again. Like, I want it so badly. I miss it. I miss the company. Okay, we need to go to Tense Against the Dark Arts. to get used to the the okay we, we wanted to go here right okay chevron seven peeves gives you mad hatter vibes definitely absolutely looks so much like mad hatter i thought that too it's kind of funny that they chose to do that <laughs> Kevin, you're not a Harry Potter fan, but your sisters are fans, at least one of them, and they're from different houses. Curious. Mm, I think my sisters have grown up in different houses, too. Hey, you love Gryffindor people. They are strong and help each other, care about each other. Yeah. I think all the houses definitely have benefits, oh. too. Like, you know, loyalty and kindness from, uh, from, um, the <laughs> Hufflepuffs. It was amazing, and, you know, intelligence and curiosity from the Ravenclaws. Even though Flurin's ambition is important too. Marco, thank you so much for gifting another five memberships. Guys, if you haven't turned on your ability to receive a membership, go do that right now so you can get the membership from Marco. That's so kind of you. Oh, we're literally gonna have everybody as a, as a member at this point. Everybody who isn't, make sure to go turn it on. All you have to do is click the three dots next to the message, I believe, that says, um, that says the membership gifting, and then you will be able to turn it on and automatically get it. So, Jamie just was gifted a membership. Oh, thank you so much, Barco. It's so sweet. Okay, I need to clearly make a Harry Potter membership for you guys so that. <laughs> um, all right, sorry. A Harry Potter emoji for you guys so that you can use it. What should I make? If you guys give me ideas, I'll make one. Ralph, if you play on your PC, you play on both modes at the same time. Yeah, I, I. Got the game before I had the PC set up, but I'm, I'm, it's, it's, it's in the process. Also, it's sitting right next to me right now. You guys can't see it, but you might see me um, touching something. That's is my PC sitting right here. <laughs> Very proud of it. He's giving off Mad Hatter vibes is a good choice, honestly. It is kind of fun. All right, on to defense against the dark arts. This is going to be cool. I wish it was taught by Severus Snape. <laughs> Hello, Fishheart313. What's a membership? Um, so it's kind of like the same thing like they have on Twitch, I guess, where um, basically if you're a member of the channel, you get certain perks. Main one is that you get to use emojis. So if you look on the in the emojis list, um, at the very top, you'll see the Amanda Rose's emojis. You get to use those in her chat, which is fun. I drew them all myself. There's my dog, some God of War ones, little, our little logo. Um, and then you'll also get to see like community posts for members, which soon I'll post some polls for you guys. Rodrigo, hello! Hey Amanda, you love this game, can't wait to see some dragons! I know, we saw one dragon last episode, which was crazy. I'm excited for more. Ralph Marco being the man of the stream again! Yes, Marco is definitely our like MVP for sure. Oh, you should turn on memberships as well so that you can, like, receive a gift. Wiggle wiggle. The butt wiggle. Yeah, that's by Molly's butt wiggle. <laughs> my dog, Molly. She likes to wiggle her butt at you. So I made her emoji of it. <laughs> oh, what's over here? Can we have tea? We can drink tea! Oh, guys, I love tea. A magic teapot set would be amazing. <laughs> Oh, also, guys, 
Discord. It's almost done. It should be released this week. Finally, I know y'all have been waiting so long for me to get it out, but it's almost here. I promise you it's coming you out now? this week. Discord is finally happening. Ooh, look at this. What are these things? That is kind of creepy. I'm not gonna lie. What are they? Well, let's go find out in Defense Against the Dark Arts. Whoa! Is that all you've got? Whoa! Uh -oh. <laughs> Professor Hecate! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. <laughs> it was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. She's funny too. No I like her. Heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death. I love that she's like this little old lady who's just badass enough to be teaching this class. <laughs> Levioso. 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 A levitation charm. Levioso. <laughs> a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Proet? No? <laughs> One thing I've learned I like her is too. unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now. Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Oh, you know, I love you so! Live you so! <laughs> oh. Um, Marco, you're happy when you can support you and give you something back to you and this awesome community for the great time. Well, we appreciate it so, so much, Marco. Honestly, it means the world to me and. I'm so happy to see other people being able to become members and enjoy that perk for a little while. It's actually not even something I can. Like, the emojis I can only give to members, like it's not, there's no option not to. So it's great that you guys get to use them and I'm excited that you guys get to, like, you know, do that because of Marco. So very, very sweet of you, Marco. Well, dang, thanks, Marco. <laughs> Where'd you go? Is Dumbledore alive in this? I know he was really old. Ooh, yeah, I'm not sure. I'm guessing not, since he's not the headmaster of the school. Maybe he's young. We got it! Leviosa. <laughs> so this is Levioso? Leviosa. <laughs> ah, just like the movies. They make the feathers float. Now, let's try something a little larger. Ah, uh, I need to do a Harry Potter watch party. Do you guys want to watch it with me? We should do that on Discord. That would be great. Is that a saw? Exactly. Cost. Um. Okay. Perform a basic cast using R two. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time. And uh, this dummy is smarter than I am. So first. <laughs> Then the basic cost. Okay. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Break through yellow shields with control spells like so the... So artfully helped me demonstrate earlier. Levitation spell, Livioso. Livioso. Now, well done. That was fun. That was so fun. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, oh, we get to go to duel. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel. You <laughs> only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. How do I defend again? <laughs> I don't remember. This should be Ah, easy. no wait, how do we do this? Uh, okay, hold on. <laughs> I gotta refresh, refresh how to do the, the buns. Oh, crap. Um... Uh, okay. Aim. Heal. Which one is lock? Okay. Try 
triangle. I don't like that that's tri that's that's block. Now perspective. <laughs> oh I don't get to I don't get to press and hold, do I? <laughs> I know. <laughs> lucky. Nothing lucky about it. This can't be your first duel. That is mean. Who's with us today? That has to help. I should heal. Do you try it? Oh, we got him. Okay, Not I definitely bad. need to work on my blocking, though. <laughs> you give as good as you get. He doesn't seem very nice. Oh, well, he's a Slytherin. <laughs> Had to be mean to Slytherins. <laughs> I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Ravenclaw. Yay! Thank you, points to Ravenclaw. Hit. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. <laughs> Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. So oh, fun! If you know oh, the hello. Spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way around. Look at this room. Oh my god, look. Is that a werewolf? Damn, they're just like in a cage here. That's creepy as hell. Oh, Jigger, now you want to see the first movie? Me too, uh, especially after just rereading the first book. I want to reread all the books. I'm guessing we can't go in here yet. No. Darn. <laughs> I can't wait to. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. Mm-hmm. I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. Oh, yeah. We can expect great for things from you. I think so. Marco, so many scenes from the movies. They care so much. It's great to see. Yeah, it's really cool that they're, like, putting these little, um... Hints in for the movies. Oh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things friendly. Nice this work. room is so crazy. Like the the bones. Creepy. Oh, look at this thing. Yeah, that's a creepy set of armor for sure. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Mm. Sebastian Sallow, by the way. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with and a wand. And it's not even our own wand yet. Then again, I'm perhaps next. this wasn't your first duel. Uh, are we gonna lie? I think we're gonna lie, I guess, so people don't know. What actually happened? In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, <gasps> unsanctioned dueling organization. I know what this is. <laughs> Sounds intriguing. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to yeah, break Yeah, we're going to break the occasional element. rule. We're going to be like Harry Whether Potter here. Whether joining <laughs> a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library. Mm, we're definitely going to do that if we can. You just clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll I solemnly swear mind. I'm a muck to no good. Pleasure chatting <laughs> with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till next time. Seven, you know we're very late, but how's the game so far? It is so good. If you are a fan of Harry Potter, you're gonna absolutely love the game. It's so true to the game. It's, it's so true to the movies and the books. It's amazing. I am having a great time with it. 
You know, like Sebastian, he seems cocky. He does seem a little bit, but he got nicer towards the end there. Oops, did not mean to cast that. <laughs> we like expect great things from you. Remember, remember you have Star Wars. <laughs> Kevin, okay, I must leave. Have a good day, Amanda and everyone. Happy Valentine's Day. Thank you so much for coming, Kevin. Happy early Valentine's Day or happy Galentine's Day. <laughs> Thanks so much for coming. I'll see you at the next live stream. Bye, Kevin. That was just a sneaky Slytherin. <laughs> All right, where to next? Weasley after class. <gasps> it's time for Ollivander's. So cool looking. Even the pots are cool. Revenia. Ah, we already got this one. Eves! Peepsy has a brand new game. Just beware the open <laughs> flame. Eves, look at him. I'm not, I'm never gonna get it. This is never gonna get old. <laughs> this is so cool. Come back. You can hit me with a flaming thing. I don't care, I just want to hang out with Peeves. He's so funny looking. I always imagined him to be like, not so colorful, you know, like a little more um, black and white. Oh. <laughs> His laugh. <laughs> I can't believe we have a Peeves. It's so cool. They got everything in this game. Yeah, how do I get down to the next floor? <laughs> I can't remember how. How did we get through here? Maybe this way? No, this goes... Oh yeah, here we go. Oh, we found a new transfiguration courtyard. Oh yeah, we've been here before. It's insane the amount of secrets you can find Hogwarts in this game. That is so cool. Like, it's amazing that they just added that kind of detail to this. I'm really impressed that they spent the time to add those secrets because it makes it feel so much more like Hogwarts knowing there's like things that you can discover. Oh, that meow. That all the kids. Oh, the room, <gasps> professor. Oh, I look, was it's a house elf. Thing, Perhaps you could help. <gasps> look at the little house elf. Oh, oh my God! Look at the cat in the portrait Dick. too. Beak. Whoa, that was cool ah, again. There you are. That was so cute! I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I, I hope they're nicer to the house elf in here. <laughs> Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Mm, maybe. <laughs> uh, hasn't Professor Fig said anything? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. <laughs> Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Yep, Professor Ronan mentioned that. <laughs> Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, didn't we already Professor hear all of this actually the last time we talked to her? Momentarily to assign your first one. Ooh, now, wait, we're not going to go to Hogsmeade? Hogsmeade? I mentioned earlier. Yes, please, We've arranged Hogsmeade. to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander, We'll connect you with the perfect. Oh, wand. I can't wait to hear that You've part. You managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. So there really is an olive. There's an olive. This is so exciting. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. 
I'm ready to go. I'm to get so to excited. This is going to be amazing. Well. Getting our own. I'd like you to what? make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Salo or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Oh, yes. Natty. All right. Are you RPG freak? But also, I actually really like Natty. So we're going with Natty. <laughs> I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent yes. choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented mm -hmm. students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? <laughs> a rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand at Ooh, I wonder who that is. Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. <gasps> butterbeer! I want butterbeer. Look at all the crazy stuff in this classroom. Speak to Professor Ronan to receive your first assignment. Assignments are types of quests given to you by Hogwarts professors that, when completed, reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mending Charm from Tarot, which is required to complete other quests. You can track assignments and their progress in the quest menu of your field guide. This is crazy! Look at the cat! That's cute. Oh, there's two cats! Okay, clearly Professor Weasley is a big fan of cats, which makes me like her even more. Ooh, what's this? Ah! I need to get that spell! <laughs> Butterbeer sounds nasty. Yeah, well, if it's just caramel flavored, then I probably like it, but it's just cool. It's, it's really just the, you know, the like, it's Butterbeer. That's it's just cool because it's Butterbeer. Look, more butterflies. But yeah, <laughs> it depends on how they make it. So many cats, like so many. When are we gonna get to see oh, owls too? Danielle, uh, possibly Danielle that I know in real life. <laughs> it is, hello, I'm glad you can make it. You want to play this game so bad, it looks like fun. It is amazing so far, I'm so happy with it. If you're a Harry Potter fan, you're literally gonna love it. I'm so happy you're actually here, guys. I know Danielle actually like, you know, outside of gaming and live streams. So I'm always excited with my, um, you know, friends come and say hi in my live streams, but you should definitely play it. You can, you can come play it on oh, my PlayStation 5 are. if you want. <laughs> Look at them casting spells. <gasps> I want to do that. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do. And an exceedingly useful one at that, the mending charm, Repero. Fixes things Danielle, right I'm up, dying. Makes a broken <laughs> we'll do soon enough, as but thank you. Blink of an eye. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. I love the way he says arranged, through, so like with his rolled eyes. It's so cool. I can't do that at all. casting Ropero in no time. The magician, yeah, you don't like butter. That's why you don't like the sound of it. I don't know if it actually has butter in it. I think it's like caramel flavored and like caramel is made with butter. So RPG Freak, is melted butter in rum drinks even a thing? Uh, I hope not. That does not sound good. <laughs> Right, I'll what start are you? on the task right away, Professor. Okay. Professor Ronan's assignment. Collect the flying page. Do the broken statue. Oh, we get to collect the pages. Okay, how do we do this it? This is the right area. Oh. I wonder where the flying page is. Rebellion. Whoa, why is it blue? Oh, here's one. Okay, wait, how do we catch it? <laughs> I think I didn't pay attention enough. Can we use the, uh, one of our spells, I'm guessing? Nope. <laughs> Let me we got it? 
Here we go. Come back. I totally was not paying attention when he said what we're supposed to do. Whoops. Let me know. Were you guys paying attention? I would catch this thing. Can I, can I grab it? <laughs> the purple spell? Oh. That makes sense. It is going purple. <laughs> Silly me. There you go. Ah! We got it! I love how they play the Harry Potter theme when you, like, complete something. It's so cool! Lumos. Revelia. It's glowing blue! Lumos. That mean... Nope. Marco! Thank you so much for another donation! A little Valentine's gift for the most beautiful witch on Hogwarts. Oh, that is so sweet! Oh, I'm gonna blush. <laughs> Thank you so much, Marco. You're so generous. That's so kind of you. <gasps> Whoa, that was cool. Okay, thank you for the tip, Jane Magician. That's what you're supposed to do. Oh, Marco, you're so kind. Happy Valentine's Day. All right, now what? Collect the flying pages in the Defense Against Art Art Tower. Okay. Page must be around here somewhere. Oh, I see it. Lumos. We got it. Oh, this makes me so happy hearing the theme song. Okay, I like that you can collect the flying pages. Everything's so interactive. Can you grab these things? Like the ones he's, he's making I trust fly? the preliminary tasks weren't too much trouble. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? <gasps> Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Ooh, these spells are a little more complicated now. They've added in more buttons. I mean, it's still not hard, but you know, <laughs> they're just adding things in, which is nice. The mending charm repair can be used to mend broken objects and pieces of the environment. That's it. Very good. Ooh. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and rushed <laughs> out. By the water? Oh, over there? That's so cool. So now all four of our spell slots are full, so I'm guessing you like switch them out to be able to use other ones? Prepare. Nicely done. <sighs> Works like a charm. That was really cool. <laughs> Pavilion. It's so pretty. This lo the location of Hogwarts is just amazing. I love it. Joseph, what are you looking forward to learn, Amanda? Is it charms and hopefully transfiguration spell? The transfiguration spell will be really cool. I can't wait to learn how to use a broomstick and fly too. What difficulty am I playing? Um, just the normal difficulty, like the middle one. Ralph, well, it's about 1 a.m. here. I better get some sleep. So see you next time, Amanda. Have fun. Thanks so much for coming, Ralph. I'm so happy you could make it. Have a good sleep. Um, I'm hoping to do a early stream this weekend, so it won't be late for you. Uh, but don't worry, I'm probably, I have to go fairly soon anyways for, uh, have, um, I need to call my sister, but, so you won't miss a whole lot, but the, the thought will be available after. Diedrich, Hogwarts looks fantastic. It does. And also, happy birthday. I hope you're having an awesome day. I'm so glad you can make it and say hello so we can wish it in person. Yeah, happy birthday, Diedrich. All right, what's what's next? <gasps> Hogsmeade! We can do Hogsmeade now. This is amazing. I'm so excited. 
actually don't want to back say too much, but check by the center statue with the Revelia. Oh, yes, thank you. No, I appreciate that's not backseat. <laughs> I appreciate those little things. It's nice to hear, so I don't miss them. I mean, I'm sure I would come back and get it later, but. Wyvern Fountain. This fountain is a transfiguration courtyard, has the likeness of a wyvern on top, and serves as a relaxing place for students to gather. Despite rumors to the contrary, possibly started by Sir Catagon, this is most assuredly not meant to be the wyvern of Y, slain by the lovely knight in spite of himself. <laughs> That's so funny. Thank you so much, Manda. Oh, I'm so happy. Did you do anything exciting today, Dietrich? To celebrate your birthday? Oh, we can't go through here. Okay, how do we get out of here? The music in this game is so, like, just... I don't know, it's so great. <laughs> I love people with the flying books, too. Avelia. Where did that come from? Oh, does it just make a bell sound every time you do this? I like that they have this. It kind of reminds me of like the focus in um, Horizon Forbidden West. It's cool. Whoa, look at the weapons on the wall. Oh, we got one. I'm just gonna use this all the time now. Points like this were used by goblins during the 1612 Goblin Rebellion to rally troops and generally annoy witches and wizards. This horn was discovered in the aftermath of the rebellion behind the Hogshead Inn with a bunch of Gor Gorgonzola stuffed inside, presumably to meet it. <laughs> That's funny. Hello. Nelly! Hello! We are looking for you. I'm excited that we used her. Natty. I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. <laughs> this could be so fun. Gabby Dragon, hello! I picked Ravenclaw for this time. So I am a Ravenclaw-Gryffindor mashup, so we decided to go with the Ravenclaw this time, but next time I will do Gryffindor. <laughs> the music just makes the scene so, like, I don't know, just so <laughs> dramatic and exciting. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Yes, I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. Of <laughs> the course. The of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. When are we gonna get owls? I want my owl. Oh. <sighs> I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. This is so pretty. Really mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. <laughs> I believe you. I have a class well, like that that I'm regretting right now. Call it elective. When your mother was the one who elected that you take it. <laughs> Look at these. There's little uh, pigs. What are they called? There's another name for them. Anyways, they're very cute. Your brothers threw you a birthday bash to a town that eventually turned into a Super Bowl party. That's so nice of them. Oh, guys, I've always wanted somebody to throw me a surprise birthday party. Nobody ever has, but I was like, that's so cool. And somebody does that. I would love a surprise birthday party someday. <laughs> Roger, you're so learn. Love it. RPG Freak, you would be a Ravenclaw Hufflepuff. Hufflepuff's a great, a great house too. I love Hufflepuffs. I am a very loyal friend, so I think that part very much fits Hogsmeade with Hufflepuff. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. This is so pretty. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas, but that's one of the few times of year I would rather. No, no, no! I definitely want to go for Christmas too. Well, I hope at some point in the game we get to see that. Oh, oh they should I really do. Mind the cold so much. Hogwarts at Christmas. It just has taken some getting used to. I did not grow up around snow. I really hope they do the holidays in this game, like oh, wait, Halloween here. and Christmas. I often spot lace wing <gasps> flies in oh, this look, area. Look. Oh, what's so special about them? They are interesting to look at, but if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. That's so cool. Also, oh, look, it's the little, it's the talking daffodil thing. The honky, look, listen to them. They literally have everything in this game. I'm so excited. <laughs> That's 
That's awesome. I want butterbeer too. I have to get some butterbeer. I just need to try it just because it's from the game. Dimension, you like having a fantasy game with bright colors and grand soundtrack? Referring to you since most fantasy media we get nowadays is dark and fantasy. It, it really is nice to have this too. Like it, it's so magical looking. Red Dragon went to my birthday and make me a surprise. Aw, July 29th. That's very sweet. <laughs> Yeah, not for a while. We've got seven months still, or a little less From now. The I guess. Forest, Five months, six months. <gasps> I wonder if something started them. I wow. heard you know that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. Look at them, guys! I want another a bunny and hippogriffs. Wow, this game is so magical. He's already seen the hippogriffs. Absolutely. Oh, this Likely is amazing. Prawn soup and sugar. That's the Forbidden oh. Forest on the left. It's off limits to students, as the name implies. Oh, Why is it off limits? I want to go in there. The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. <laughs> ah, there's Hogsmeade over the crest, past that ruin. I love these things so much. <laughs> Listen to them. And the controller vibrates too. <laughs> I love the sounds they make. This is amazing. All right, off to Hogsmeade. The Forbidden Forest does look pretty appealing right now. It's, it's, it looks pretty. It doesn't look dangerous from this angle, at least. You can walk by holding the left stick slowly if you want to take in the view, by the way. Okay. Look at the ruins, too. Wow, and Hogwarts is huge. I would spend all of my time exploring if I could. Mm -hmm. I confess, I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you were here. <gasps> Look at the mushrooms! Since you're relatively new here. Leaping toadstools. She said that. Mm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will say, while I certainly learn a great deal in class, much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. This is so pretty. Look at the flowers. And the butterflies. Amazing. Oh, and you can use the tracks for the train. The Hogwarts best goes. I love the leaping toadstools. I almost don't want to pick them because they're like, they're really cute. <laughs> Robin, this game brings the inner child in you. I was saying the same thing. I literally feel like a kid again playing this. Like, my glee. I'm just like childlike glee right now. Like, I'm so happy I can't stop smiling. I mean, you can find the giant spider right now in that forest. Ooh, that would be really cool. How are you settling in? I would in? love that. I remember the weeks that followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. What is I'm that? used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? I still miss my homeland, but it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust oh. <laughs> a bit. Hogwarts has become something of oh, a home like now. That. I would oh. say. Hopefully it will for you too. Okay, that's cool. I like collected like that. Hogwarts view, isn't it beautiful? I love that you can see the greenhouse too. And all the towers. Oh, I love towers. I've always wanted to have a tower room to live in. Or like have it be like a book corner to read. Just like sit in a tower and read. Mr. Moon! He is the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hmm. Do the pictures and the grand Hello, staircase have moving things do? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss On I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? <laughs> what is up with him? He sounds very right drunk. Me. Eyes big as saucers. What did Mr. What Moon... are you talking about? Jelly guys. Dougly and Aryan. Oh, fine. <laughs> I shall be drunk. the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. <laughs> He's oh, so Mr. drunk. Moon. A Debbie, guys. I think he had too much fun in the village. Uh huh. I will say that I, think I have never seen him in such a state. <laughs> that was goofy. Hey there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. 
This game is so nostalgic. Classic magical fantasy in general. Yeah. Goblins and such. It might be nice to have a friend with you. Okay. Look at the tree. Thank you. It's so pretty. The village. And the music. Oh, and look at everybody with their hats. Oh my gosh, this place is so cool. And here we are. It is hard to know where to start. I love the music. The Three Broomsticks is the place for butter beer. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. Oh, I want to go to Honey Dukes. I could not choose I a candy. favorite shop here. <laughs> it changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. This is so neat. It looks exactly as I would imagine it. Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spell crafts, some seeds, and... I like the music that goes with this. Of course. A new you will one. enjoy Mr. Ollivander. Ooh, I'm and so I'm excited keen to, to see go there. what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Oh, Experience I'm so excited Hogsmeade to explore. Your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Oh, this is, this is great. I will see you soon. Hogsmeade Village is brimming with different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate using your field guide map. Wow, look at it. There's so much to see here. The Hogsmeade map shows shops and points of interest. You can track any of these by highlighting an icon and pressing X. Press O to X the to exit the Hogsmeade map. Ooh, which one is which one's Ollivander's? I want to go there right now. Sporting these so we can go go get our Quidditch stuff. Okay, we're going here first because I'm so excited to get our wand. <laughs> Too much butter beer for him? Oh yes, clearly. <laughs> and yet the students are allowed to drink butter beer, so is there alcohol in it? <laughs> Victor, hello! Oh my god, it's your room Amanda, but I can't stay today. You're heading to a meeting, so dang it, I would be another day. Greetings, Amanda, and this awesome community you enjoy for me. Thanks so much for stopping by to say hello. I'm sorry you can't stay, but don't worry, there'll be lots more live streams coming soon, so I will see you at the next one. By the way, you look awesome, Amanda. Thank you. So, so you remember reading the books and watching the Harry Potter movies and playing the game makes me feel like a kid again. It really does. So much. Like, look at this place. Look at this shop. Ugh, we can't go in here. It's so colorful. I love all the floating teapots. Ariel, hello, you're new here. Where's the butterbeer? Settle down, grab yourself some butterbeer and get cozy for some Hogwarts legacy. Welcome, I'm so glad you make it. We are just about to go to Ollivander's to get our own wand. So exciting. Then, just saw something glowing. Oh, here we go. Field guide. Ollivander's wand shop. Wands of a variety of wood and all manner of flexibility, each possessing one of three magical cores, choose their owner in this cozy, cluttered shop run by the amiable and knowledgeable Gerbold Ollivander. In the profession of wandcraft since 382 BC, the Ollivander family are considered the best wand rankers in Britain, if not the world. Oh, I cannot wait. <laughs> We're gonna get our own wands. Ooh, there's something here. Look at this shop! Look at all the wands. This is exactly, again, exactly how I'd imagine Ollivander used to look. Oh, I wonder what they're gonna do to get, us, get our wand picked. I'll be right. What kind when... of wand am I gonna get? Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. He seems to know us. Uh, mm. oh, I really want to go to the wand shop that you can go to in Harry yes. Potter world. It's about it's time. So cool. Yes, I. About time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Look at his one. the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. He is very, it's very proud of that. <laughs> to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? Am I good at that? No, Unicorn no, horn, you. the phoenix um, feather, or what is the ah, last one? Yeah. I can't remember right now. Yes. Hmm. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches. Hmm. You might do. Here. Give this one a try. Ooh, it's pretty. Dragon heart well, string. That's the one. Wish. Nope. Hmm. <laughs> Not that one. How odd. 
Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Woo! <gasps> it's so colorful. All right. Well, this Another isn't good one. at all, is it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, I don't think it tells us which core we get. Mm. Hi, Invisible uh, Guardian. Welcome, yeah, you made uh, it. Uh, perhaps. Yes. Dragon heart Red string on this one. 13 and three quarter inches, dragon heart string. What do you guys Let's think I'll get? Wanna try. Is it the same for everybody too, or do we all get different ones? Such a fun cutscene. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be all the chaos of like things just flying everywhere. How perplexing. <laughs> um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Yes, I think you might be the one. Third time's the charm. Here, take it. We get to customize our wand. Do we get to customize our wand? Wait, do we? Is this? Oh my God, we get to pick what our wand looks like? I had no idea we got to do this. This is so exciting. What? I'm so excited! This is amazing. Make your own wand. Oh, I'm so happy. How interesting. Ooh, that's pretty. This is so cool. I can't believe they do this for us. Ooh. Curious indeed. Ooh. Kind of like maybe this one. Oh, and you can even pick colors. Ooh. I really like the black is kind of cool actually. I really like that. How intriguing. This one is nice too. I really like the color of this one. The shape. Oh, what's this one made of? Classic gray. Curious light brown indeed. soft spiral. Oh, it's so hard to pick. They're all like. Ooh, the ringed dark the ringed one is pack is kind of How nice. How intriguing. Oh, I like that. This is so neat. I'm so happy right now. I can't believe we get to do this. I kind of like this one. It's, it's either this one or the the black one. I This one's really nice too. Let's see what else we have in here. What type? How intriguing. Oh, you can change the wood type. Oh, I need to make it long. 13 and 3 quarters. I'm gonna make mine. Yes, indeed. Ooh. Eleven and three quarters. Wow. This is like they really thought about people who were gonna be playing this game and like what we would wanna see with this. Like it's so neat having played read the books and, and like hear them talk about like the different wand properties to now actually be able to build our own wand based on that. Making this game putting all our wishes in the game. Exactly! They put gave us everything we how intriguing. Swishy! Surprisingly swishy! Okay, we're going with that. <laughs> Just because it's cool. Surprisingly swishy. Curious indeed. I like that. Let's see, which one of these do I recognize? Swish oak, elm. I think I'm probably. Ooh. I'm gonna make How it ash. Intriguing. Or willow? Silver? What was that? Where did it go? Oh, silver lime. Interesting. I think I'm gonna make it. Curious indeed. And apple. Ooh. I'm gonna make it an ash. Oh, and now we get to pick what's inside it. <gasps> Unicorn horn, phoenix feather, or dragon heart spring. I'm gonna go with the phoenix feather. Uh -huh. Phoenix feather. Okay. Exceptionally rare, and a core with a strong sense of initiative. I kind of, I think I might. How intriguing. I think I might go with this one. I 
I really like the spirals in it. Okay. Yes, indeed. Either the white one, I think I'm gonna go with this wand type, and then I'm either gonna go with that color, or the white. How intriguing. I'm gonna go with the honey brown. This is it, this is my wand. <sighs> Invisible Guardian, you did the black sauce spiral and it was in your Potter more out. The white. I really like, yeah. I like that one too. It's definitely my second choice, but I think I'm gonna go with this one. Little Jason Handsome, you love Harry Potter too. You love and happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Thank you for coming, hanging out with me today. Yeah, I love Harry Potter too. This is this is so neat. Curious indeed. I think I yeah, I think I like this one. I like the natural. Looks awesome, Amanda. Robin, you're from Hufflepuff, but your coven room is so beautiful. The Ravenclaw one is absolutely gorgeous. I can't wait to see Hufflepuff too, though. Okay, this is our wand. 11 and 3 quarters inch. All right, that's what I did. Surprisingly squishy, 11 and 3 quarters inches and ash. Although I feel like ash doesn't quite make sense. I think I'm gonna go with Alder. How intriguing. Yes, Alder. Okay, this is my wand. So beautiful! Oh. Wow. Natural honey brown, alder, phoenix feather, surprisingly squishy, 11 and 3 quarter inches. What do you wow. think? Wow, look at it! It's so beautiful. The alder one for Amanda Roses. <laughs> Extraordinary. Wow. That's so pretty. <laughs> Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> this is so cool. Now, I'm how so did happy. that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Of course. And a phoenix feather core is terribly selective. This will be an excellent match indeed. And it's the like bond Potter. between you yeah, and the your phoenix. wand should or only well, grow right? stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. That was amazing. I love the detail they put in that scene. It was everything I wanted from Ollivander's shop and getting our own wand. <laughs> Little Jason Handsome, you've watched Uncharted 4 when you played it. It's kind of Im impressive. I love Uncharted 4. That is a fantastic game. I honestly really want to replay the earlier Uncharted games with you guys because I played them a long time ago. But it's been a while and I love them so much. They're one of my favorite series, so it'd be amazing. It would be great to play with you guys again. Just so you picked a unicorn hair? I like the unicorn hair too. Jay Magician, too bad they didn't have a rosewood option. I know, that would have been perfect. That would have been really cool, actually. So Jason, you're a Ravenclaw, by the way? Oh, I'm a Ravenclaw too! At least in this playthrough. I'm also a Gryffindor. I'd say I'm split between the two, but Ravenclaw right now. Especially since I am in school and a graduate student, I feel like Ravenclaw really fits. <laughs> I mean, how did the scar happen? What's your story about that? Oh, I hadn't really thought of a story. I just thought it looked really cool. I don't have a scar. Actually, I do have a scar. I used to say I had a Harry Potter scar because I have a little scar. It's really faint. Like, you wouldn't be able to see it right now unless you were looking. Like, unless I showed you up close. But I do have a little scar right here from when I was younger, so. Invisible Guardian, you said a pic in Twitter? Is this something I should check right now? Hold on a second. Ooh, is that your wand? Super nice, I like it. Yeah, feel free to send me pictures of your guys' wands and your characters. Is it us again? That was amazing! Oh, I love the music in here. Okay, where are we going next? I'm so happy. This is This is so neat. Thumbs and scrolls. I just want to see everything, honestly. I might just run around until we see it all. Zonkos? T tricks and jokes? Can we go in here? Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, this is awesome. Look, the moon's coming out. Oh, this is so magical. This place. Look at the balloons. Look, this looks like Shrek. It's a Shrek balloon. I love it. I, I looked at the picture of the Guardian. It's really cool. I love your wand choice. Look at all the posters! Gillyweed Tonic. I can't believe they have so much detail in this. Demogician, you gotta head out, but glad you're enjoying the game so far. Have a good one, guys. Thanks so much for coming, Demogician. See you at the next live stream. Enjoy playing Hogwarts in the meantime. Tempest in a bottle. Oh, I want that. Look at this. I can't believe they have all of this here. <laughs> Is that a boxing frog? That's hilarious. The music too. Little Jason, Rose, I love your channel and it's almost your birthday. It's coming up March 30th. You're turning 22. Happy almost birthday. Hopefully I will try and have a live stream. Okay, I actually will be in Disney World on March 22nd, so we won't be able to live stream on your birthday. But when it's close to your birthday, I will make sure to do a, a happy birthday when I see you on a live stream around then. And thank you so much for saying that about my channel. I really appreciate that. I love you guys. Ooh, bewildering can of mystery. <laughs> that was amazing. Can we keep opening them? Oh, just one. I want to like open a whole bunch to see what else is in here. This place is so colorful. Don't push. <laughs> Too bad. I pushed it before I even read the sign. Wait, look! It's a Niffle! Niffle! What is it called? Oh, why do I always forget their names? Look at him! I want to see one in the game. If they don't show us one in the game soon, I'm... I'm gonna be sad. <laughs> Exploring was one of the reasons you got the game, and also learning the spells. Exploring is the thing I am most excited about by far. Niffler! I always, like, mess it up just slightly. <laughs> Little Jason, you've been watching your channel almost a month now? I don't know. Love you so much. Oh. I love you too. I'm so happy you found our channel. I'm so glad you're in our live stream today too. Which video brought you to the channel? I'm curious. What was it like? How did you find us? <laughs> Look at the unicorns. This place is awesome. <laughs> this balloon is hilarious. Oh, what's over here? <gasps> okay, that's creepy. The way it like goes down like that? No, no. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna explore all the stores here. I must see everything. All of it. I have to. Oh, I can't wait to be able to unlock things. <laughs> I'm just gonna break into everybody's houses. Spinning potion! It's potions time! Whoa! Look at the sign. Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. Oh, this is so pretty. Wow. Oh, we got gloves. Oh, you can dress your character up. Look at all the plants. Hello, P Perry Pippin. <laughs> Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, Who's I that? don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the side, Harry of course, Pippins. but Grandfather <laughs> always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like look I was Look at the potion in the corner. They look so detailed. Potion supplies. Is it not Ooh, the most fascinating I can't wait to make potions potion too. making? Rivals, anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all Ooh, manner of Oh, I can be by. And 
What potion would you guys get? If you could get any potion, what would you want? Pop in when you can, so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Liquid Lock would be pretty cool. Marco, thank you so much for donating my my memberships. Oh, guys, make sure to go turn on your memberships so that you can accept them. Invisible Guardian, Little Jason, if you click on the three dots next to the Marco Jander's gift, you can you can be one of the recipients. Oh, thank you so much, Marco. You are single-handedly making sure everybody on this channel can be a member. That is amazing of you. I seriously need to put a Harry Potter emoji in here. Little Jason, it takes a few days to find your channel and I search up your channel. I'm like, who is she? She's kind of gorgeous, so I found you. Oh. <laughs> Wait, so you were looking for a new channel and you managed to find mine? I'm so curious how people like arrive here. Go into the place and do Revelio? Ooh. Yeah, the luck potion. Love potion on Sebastian. <laughs> the strength potion, that would be pretty cool. Look at all of these. Okay, so we can a Juros potion. Recipe for a potion that causes the rocky film to develop on the consumer's skin, helping to protect them from harm. Oh, that sounds really creepy, but helpful. I guess we definitely want the recipe for this one. Do we have any money? Oh, oh, these are free. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Ooh, recipe for a potion that makes a drinker practically invisible. I want that. Do we have any money? Oh, we only have hundred dollars, so <laughs> we're not really buying much of anything today. You can sell stuff, but it's not going to give us enough for all of this. Look at all the ingredients. They're actually really pretty. Okay. That's, we can't afford anything, so. <laughs> so, just in your favorite video, mine is playing Uncharted 4. Well, I better play some of the other Uncharted games then. I would love to if we get a chance. We have so many games to play, but if you have suggestions for other games you want to see, I'm always open to them. And that goes for everybody. This is, oh, Revelia, that's what I was going to do. Ah! I better, I need to remember to use this more often. Dave Pippin's Potions. Dave's Pippin's Potions, established in 1753, is the apothecary in Hogsmeade where proprietary Perry Pippin sells a wide variety of potions and their ingredients. That is a tongue twister right there. <laughs> that was awesome. I love that we get that. Oh. All right, we got everything in here. Ah, oh, this game is amazing. I love it so much. Little Jason him, can you do something on your birthday or your channel this year? I unfortunately am going to be on vacation on March 22nd. Otherwise I would, but I'm going to be, um, I'm going to be away. I won't have access to be able to live stream or really do anything. Otherwise I would, but I will try and schedule a live stream beforehand. I wish you a happy birthday. I love that she's doing magic. Okay, let's see what else is on this map. Oh, yes. Okay, I want to go see what's in this corner. Hogshead! Oh, we got a flu flame. <laughs> I love that word. Flu flame. Oh, hedge trimmers. This is awesome. The music is so great. <laughs> found the emojis. I really need to add some more emojis. What's in here? Look at this statue. Look at this thing. Look at how cute he is. Revenia. This guy's adorable. Let's see if any of these spells. What does the glowing mean? Ah. Are we at the bar? Is this where you get butterbeer? <laughs> Sit down and have a butterbeer? Is that what we can do here? Oh my god, it's butterbeer, isn't it? It's butterbeer! Did we just have butterbeer? <laughs> this is... Lumos. Oh, we got it! Mounted Hogshead! 
That is strange looking. That's a little creepy. This mounted hot's head rolls its eyes and snuffles its nose as it oversees the sea atmosphere and decidedly interesting clientele at the hog's head. <laughs> Look at him! Got so much like, um... <laughs> much drool coming out. He's kind of creepy, I'm not gonna lie. We're gonna get drunk if we drink too much butterbeer. I want butterbeer right now. I should really, I should really make some butterbeer. <laughs> That's neat. Little Jason, yeah, 2022, you're quite nervous. Why are you nervous? What makes you nervous about it? I've been 22, it's not so bad. <laughs> Just a fact, I find your channel during your Uncharted 4 playthrough. I was like, wow, this girl is beautiful and been watching your videos every time. I'm actually surprised that two people here found me through Uncharted 4. I didn't think that was one of my more popular playthroughs. Most people find me through God of War, but I'm glad you guys like the Uncharted 4 one because I love Uncharted, so, and that was a fantastic game. Is it me, your character in Hogwarts is British? <laughs> My character is, uh, yeah, I think most of the characters are British. I have a terrible British accent, so. No way that passes in OSHA health inspection. Yeah, definitely not. Um, Texans of an oh man, I just looked it up. Blue glowing statues items are cross-related items. Oh, interesting. So I wonder if we get to do something with them a little later on. RPG for it. You found me through Ratchet and Clank. Oh, that is a throwback. I love that game. It was so well made. Like, literally incredible use of the PlayStation 5 technology. I don't think it gets enough recognition. We're just stealing food left and right here, aren't we? She's gonna herself very drunk. <laughs> yeah, that was a great game. I really enjoyed playing it. Robin, happy Valentine's Day. So your character, Valentine, is Sebastian? Is that who my character's Valentine is? Can be. <laughs> I think my Valentine is all of you guys. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> and Soul Guardian, go to Starbucks and they can make it. It's a secret menu if they don't look it up on how and show them. Ooh, I should do that. Before our next live stream, I should go get some butter beer at Starbucks. Starbucks. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so that I can drink it while I'm hanging out with you guys. Next time you seem so not sure. Okay, I'll just wait. Hello, Jason. I'm 21 years old. I've been making YouTube almost four years now. Wow, that's a long time. Well, I'm 24. Um, I've only been making YouTube for two years. Okay. Well, guys, I really want to keep playing, but unfortunately, I have to go do... I had promised my friend I would hang out with her tonight because she just got engaged, which I'm really excited for her. And she wanted to tell me all about it. So I told her it'd be around 7 30 so i probably shouldn't keep playing for too much longer but honestly it's really hard to stop because i want to keep exploring this area and it's so amazing like everything is so cool it's so detailed and i want to go see all the shops hi michael um, how are we all loving this game i am absolutely obsessed with it it's so good it looks exactly like what I would want for Harry Potter. Like, I have no complaints so far. Congrats to her. I know, it's so exciting. Call your sister. Oh yes, thank you for the reminder, Texan 7. I should also call my sister. <laughs> it seriously is so addicting. Marco, you found me through your God of War videos and you're a quick fan. Yeah, God of War is definitely my most popular playthrough. Sometimes I joke that I've just become like a God of War channel, but <laughs> I'm still gonna play other games like this. Because if you're going to Starbucks tomorrow for butterbeer, right? Me too. I'm like nervous it's probably not going to taste that good, but I have to try it. I need my butterbeer. Michael, y'all, you peed your pants running to the bathroom because I couldn't stop playing? <laughs> uh, I can't say I've done that, and I can't say I will, but <laughs> it is a fantastic game. The detail, yeah, it's really impressive. Oh, I love it so much. It's actually really hard to put this game down. Like, I could easily continue playing with you guys for another two hours. But, gotta call my sister, call my friend who just got engaged. But I, pl I am planning on doing a lot of live streams, like, since this just came out. Um, and I'm really excited to play it, so I am planning on doing a lot of live streams with you guys, so don't worry, I will have another one soon. Uh, what day is it? It's Monday? Possibly Wednesday or Thursday. I'll definitely do one this weekend and then another one sometime this week. We're just gonna play a ton of Harry Potter or Hogwarts because I'm so happy with this game, it was so fun. 
it's Monday. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with me and playing this. Uh, okay. Yeah. Switching this over to this screen. Um, but yeah, I am so incredibly happy with this game. Like, thank you to Tex for, like, for getting it for me to help me play it. Um, happy Valentine's Day to everybody. I know it's not quite Valentine's Day for some of you, but happy early Valentine's Day. I hope you guys have an awesome day. Let the people you know, let the people that you love know that you love them. Today doesn't just have to be a day to celebrate. Valentine's Day doesn't just have to be about celebrating like a relationship. It can also be about celebrating the people you love. So tell them you love them. And you know, you guys, I love all of you. Um, you're all my, my favorite people. So happy Valentine's Day. Diedrich, you gotta go check out, go back home. Happy Valentine's Day. Ha Thank you, Diedrich. Happy Valentine's Day. And also happy birthday. I hope I don't know if it's still your birthday right now, what time it is there, but <laughs> um, I hope you really enjoyed your day and I'm really glad you were able to come by so we could wish you a happy birthday in person. Texans and having a wonderful night, Amanda. Happy Valentine's. Thanks, Texans and Amanda. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day as well. Um, Chevron 7 plus the Discord launch party. It's coming. It's almost done. I'm literally going to try and finish it tonight and release it like in the next couple days. So it is coming. I really tried with this. I know you guys have been waiting for so long for it, so I've been working really hard, but it's coming soon. Then we have a place to like chat outside of live streams. Michael, absolutely. Robin, you're new here, but already um, love how you were playing this game with so much passion. Thank you, Robin. I really appreciate you saying that. I am honestly in love with this game. I love Harry Potter. I always have. I've been a huge fan forever, and it's like absolutely magical to be playing this game and to get to play with you guys. I'm really excited to see your guys' passion for it too. So I hope we'll stick around for our other live streams. There will be plenty more, I promise you that. So if you got tickets for the new Ant-Man, oh yes, and Wasp movie, I'm so excited to see it. I have not booked my tickets yet. I need to do that immediately because I wanna watch it on, I wanna watch like the, the release day. I'm, it looks really good. Texas 7, much love, Amanda. Stay safe, everyone. Thank you. Much love back. I'm so glad you're enjoying it. Diedrich, bye, guys. Have fun. Love you, Amanda. My friends later. Love you, too, Diedrich. Love all of you guys. Marco, have a great time, Amanda. Thank you. Joseph, see you next time. Till next time, y'all. All right, I'm going to sign off now, but I love you guys so, so much. Happy Valentine's Day to my absolutely favorite people, and have a magical evening. I will see you in the next live stream soon. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.